Hi, this is, uh, John. Um, well, I've been up to, uh, my family's property. And they got a lot of unusual rocks up there. Um, not exactly a mineral mineralogist or a geologist or anything by any means. Um, well, there's some, uh, kind of unique rocks. And, uh... Uh, I'm just not sure what they are or exactly how they formed. Um, they kind of look like um, some meteorites that I've seen, but so I went through, put them through some of the tests, and uh, they passed some of the tests, but also they're not passing some of the tests. I don't know if it's simply lava stone or uh, just kind of uniquely uh, worn warm rocks, but, I mean, some of them are magnetic, but they're not supposed to be porous, um, if it is a meteorite, but, um, I don't know, they're just kind of odd looking rocks, something that I would imagine, you know, maybe potentially coming through the atmosphere, and kind of burning it up, but it may be wrong, so uh, I mean, if you have any insights or um, maybe know what, what some of this material is or how it may have formed, I'd be curious to know. Um, again, just kind of unusual. Um, there's a bigger, bigger one. Looks like it has a what they this particular one. Although it is porous and it's, I mean it's really heavy. It's yeah, it's a pretty dense rock. I mean it's it's magnetic. Looks like it has a fusion crust. Um, it does have some of the uh, smooth, smooth edges, uh, like some of the meteorites. Um, but I've kind of cracked it open, and it is, uh, seems to be the same material all the way through. Although it's a little denser, it seems, towards, uh, you know, the exterior, and then towards the uh, rear of the rock, it seems to become a little more porous. Still, still heavy. Um, and again, uh, let me get the, uh, Magnet that I mean it's not a rare earth magnet by any but but yeah maybe uh if we get an expert out there somebody who's a little more knowledgeable and can gain give me uh, some assistance uh. Please do leave uh, comments or uh, some insight or maybe some guidance, you know, to help uh, identify uh, what these are and how they're formed. Alright, thank you.